first things first, you're gonna need some Jiffy cornbread. I'm using three boxes of Jiffy corn muffin mix and um, I'm just following the instructions that are on the box. So each box needs one egg and one third cup of milk. So I'm going ahead and adding three eggs and I'm doing the one third cup of milk three times because I'm using three boxes. So yeah, just follow the box instructions to make the cornbread. Mix it really well. Make sure we, all the ingredients are incorporated. Add as much milk as you need to get the consistency that you want, you know. And you're going to pour it into a greased baking dish. And you're going to bake it at 400 degrees. I think for about 15 to 18 minutes. Now you're going to need to dice up an onion. I was struggling with these onions. I hate small onions. And you're gonna dice up some green bell peppers, red bell peppers, and yellow bell peppers. This is gonna go inside of your dressing. Make sure you clean your bell peppers before you cut them up so that they're, they're nice and clean. Wash your vegetables, people. <laughs> Now over medium heat, I am melting down some butter and I'm gonna add my veggies that I cut up and I'm just going to go ahead and saute these until they get soft. When that cornbread's done and cooled off, you wanna go ahead and scoop it into a bowl so that you can crumble it up. Get it crumbled really well, use your hands, use a spoon, use whatever you need to do to get it crumbled up really fine so that you can have a nice smooth consistency with your dressing. Go ahead and add those vegetables that you sauteed in the butter. As you can see, they got nice and soft for me. Hey. Okay, and I add in some um, stovetop sage mix. I don't add the whole thing in, I just add about three fourths of it. And I make my own chicken broth, so I add the chicken broth in there, which is water and chicken base. And you're gonna go ahead and add it into a pan. And you're gonna bake it at 350, covered for about 30 to 40 minutes. And that's all. 